Today is Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day, and we thought it would be a great day to talk about this. Now, we know about the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King and his fight on for equality. It lives on. Now, not only in our country's history, but in pop culture as well. So let's take a look back at some of the actors that have portrayed the legendary man over the years. Now, first of all, we have Paul Winfield, who I thought did an amazing job. Now, he was the first to star as MLK Jr. in the 1978 three-part biopic King, which earned him an Emmy nomination, as well as his co-star, Cicely Tyson, who played Coretta and the late Ozzy Davis, who played Daddy King. Not gonna lie, every year I would wait to watch this with my family. Mm -hmm. It was like one of the depictions that we always waited to see because it was just so good, so right. telling. It was truthful. Like, I saw it so much as a kid. Like, when I would see Paul Winfield, I was like, oh, that's Martin Luther King. <laughs> like, right. he did that good of a job yep. playing him. Right. Well, I thought David Oyelowo will set the bar high for his portrayal of Dr. King in 2014 Selma, which was filmed right here in Atlanta and earned him a Best Actor nomination from the Golden Globes and Critics' Choice Awards. Oh, yeah, he did amazing. Yeah, he's always, he's a great actor. Mm -hmm. Well, Samuel Jackson is said to have been an usher at MLK's funeral, so I think it's cool that he portrayed the leader on stage in the Broadway play The Mountain. Top. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't either. I picture wow. him as like off duty MLK. Man, he's <laughs> we're tripping today. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> the MLK side we don't right. know or yeah. hear about. We take his tie off. Right, exactly. <laughs> then we have Jeffrey Wright. He's known for playing iconic roles like Felix Slater and James Bond franchise, as well as Colin Powell in the political drama W. And he played Dr. King in Boycott, a film that focused on the Montgomery bus boycotts. I'm not gonna lie, this actor is so dynamic. He can play a mixed person, he can yes. play a Hispanic person, he yep. can play Asian, he can yep. play black. He can turn into anything and yep. it, it's so believable. A politician, like, a drug yes. dealer, a yes. drug yes. saw him in yes. Shaq when he yes. was Peoples Hernandez. Yes. I was like, how's people people and then there's going to be MLK. Then when I saw it, I believed it. Yeah. That's right. It's He's a great actor. He's amazing. And lastly, New York undercover star Malik Yoba played MLK in the 2013 Lifetime movie Betty and Coretta, which starred Angela Bassett as Coretta Scott King and Mary J. Blige as Betty Shabazz. Ooh. Yeah. Now, I haven't seen this one. I need to see this one. So, okay, y'all. So, who do y'all think, honey, um, should play MLK next in 2020? I mean, I don't know, like, if his son is interested in acting, but his sons look so much like yeah. him, like yes. Dexter also. King and all of them. Like, mm -hmm. I think if he, like, you know, like, fasted for a couple weeks, I think he could totally play his pops. Yeah. Yeah, well, I think Gucci Man should play him. Okay, Gucci Man. <laughs> 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 no, I didn't. I was speaking another language. <laughs> Danny, I don't, I didn't know that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know who I was thinking? Idris Elba. It just Elba. He, I think yeah. he could. I think he can embody it. Yeah. Y'all think? Uh -huh. Y'all see that? Which Elba? The one back on then or the new one? Well, he's the only new one. one. He old now, so. Just... Like you know what? Chase lusting after MLK. It's gonna change the whole weird narrative. Well, it would have been a different life we saw him. They lusted after him then too. Yeah, yeah I'm sure. Trust.